in gluing up, you're going to want to have um, some blocks here to help uh, rest the clamps on. Uh, but you don't. These uh, you want something to keep these pins from pushing this up, um, and you're not going to get an even clamp uh, unless you have something like this. So I, I'm going to make a few, th four of these to go over all of the pins. I'm going to just uh, chisel that out a little bit, maybe less than an eighth of an inch, and then that way when these sit on top of here, there'll be a, a space for, for these uh, pins to come up through in case there's any extra pushing through. I did a pretty good job of, of not having these too high up, but sometimes they're up a little bit higher, so you need something. So just make these bigger than what your pins are going to be. Um, doesn't need to fit them exactly or anything, but just so that when you get on them, it'll be able to just uh, go up inside of these little holes. All right, because this is in pine, this was super easy to cut really fast. You can see it's bigger than the, <clears throat> than the uh, pins, um, but it's going to more than cover them. And then just do four of these, and that will give you some good blocks for each of each of the uh, sides with the, with the pins sticking out. All right, I don't have any hide glue, so I'm going to use just use some Tight Bond Two. Uh, you can use Tight Bond Three to to uh, give you a little extra time. But uh, so go ahead and paint all the joints, the areas where they're going to be touching. The wood's going to be touching each other, um, such as in between all these areas and on the backs of the tails. And you want to do this really quickly, so I'd probably recommend doing. Uh, a corner here and a corner here, so you have a U, and then uh, tap, you know, tap one end of the top, tap them in, and then uh, flip it up and do the the top. And uh, so I'll try to cover it as best I can. You want to be really quick because uh, you don't want your glue to dry before you get the box square. Okay, and then just go ahead and do the same and put your top on. Again, make sure that your arrows are on the right side. All right, so I got it's all clamped up and uh, it's probably smarter to do this with another person or two so you can put all the, get, get all the glue on faster. But uh, then I go around and adjust all the clamps until I uh, get this square. So you can see I what I did was um, measured from this corner to this corner and made a mark and then from this corner to this corner and I adjusted the clamps until they were <coughs> equidistant from each other for, or until they were the equal distance between the two corners there. Um, so that's I'm sure there's some some other <laughs> ways to get it better but uh, being with myself here tr trying to glue this myself it's uh, important just to get it Clamped. So that's how you, the basics of how you uh, glue up your dovetail box. <laughs>